that. <laughs> right, okay, let's um, just have introductions along the line, please. Um, hello, I'm Jane Cox, and I play Mrs. Lippy. Stephen Boys, I'm playing Mr. Libby. Hello, I'm Helen Lahan, and I'm writer, production designer. I'm special to write my own microphone. And I'm Michael Lahan, I'm the. Uh, why am I? Oh, I was editor, and I did the director, and producer, and then writer. Okay, right, okay. Let's start. Mr. Michael. Yes. Let's start. Idea. Give us a little quick journey. Okay, I've been right. directing for about 16 years, um, doing TV drama and commercials. And uh, in 2010, uh, January 2010, uh, we were in our local village, which is Marble Bridge, where we filmed the film, um, in Libby's Bakery. Um, and uh, I wanted to change my direction. Um, I felt that my directing ability was different to what was available to me in TV. TV would only allow you to uh, do, do certain you know, styles of directing. Um, you were limited to uh, the producers um, and the executives and the money that was available. Um, and my ambition um, and scope was you know, very different. So myself and Helen were standing in the bakery at on New Year's Day. Basically, we kind of had a conversation. You wanted to get into feature films. Yeah, I wanted to do I wanted to do features. Let's not beat you know. around the bush. Yeah, that's yeah. what you wanted. I wanted to spend our savings and you making a short film at the end of the day. Because like, what can we do to get attention? Yeah, we yeah. need attention, we yeah. need the industry to, to, um, to give you some attention. And what could we do to do that? And we knew we needed to make something that was polished, Hollywood-esque. And um, so far, it seems to have done the trick. Yeah, yeah, we, we wrote uh, Mrs. Peppercorn in, what was it, like three days? <gasps> yeah, we wrote the script in about three days. We, it was quick. Was like, in in my side, yeah. I would like to have given a little bit more time to it. <laughs> yeah. We wrote the script in three perfect. days, um, about two weeks later we were filming. Um, so we it was were, very, very quick. And yeah. um, we contacted everybody we knew uh, in the film industry that we'd obviously worked with in TV and so forth. Um, and blanked and blanked and blanked and blanked. Oh, <laughs> and we contacted Jane and Stephen, um, who are amazing actors and actors. Can, can, can I just jump straight in? Because I'm, I'm from Bristol. And it's quite a thing to. By the way, well, well done. Yeah, yeah. And well, well, the thing I live in Chester, it's not far away. Yeah, but the fact, the fact of the matter is, it's quite interesting to hear, because I, I could hear the accents straight away. So my question to you is why? Why? Why what? Why what? Why um, Cornish? Uh, well, and you're coming from Marple, Marple Bridge. Interestingly, that came up this evening, that question, didn't it, Stephen? Yeah, yeah. He was asking me about why that came out. My uncle and auntie uh, moved to um, Cornwall right, okay. 25 years ago, 30 years ago, 30, 25 years ago. And I spent my summers in Cornwall and um, right down to Land's End that way and I spent a good four or five weeks of my summer down there so when we sat in a coffee shop in Marble Bridge chatting about it it was just really it just kind of um, we talked about this magical reading room and I always felt there was a magic that came with Cornwall. When did we speak we spoke about the magical well you know as women they determine everything <laughs> so I just went with everything she said no I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, it just kind of moved in that direction, as all things do creatively. They just progressively move in a direction, and that's how it moves <coughs> in a direction. Sorry, it's something that was very familiar. I'm kind of uh, getting to. I mean, would you? Would, how, how casting? How? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Um, well, uh, Mike, Mike had worked. Uh, I work on a, on a soap, um, which I've been doing for the last 15 years. Although I've been in the business for about 40 years. Um, <laughs> and um, Mike had worked uh, on Emmerdale, uh, assisting, uh, working with a, another director there, um, and phoned 
my agent and, and sent a copy of the script and said, would Jane be interested in doing that? And I said, well, I would love to um, and ask permission because I have to do that because I'm committed to Emmerdale. Um, and they let me do it as well, so that was over the weekend. Mm -hmm. And then um, when I heard it was based around Cornwall, that was interesting because I grew up in Devon. Um, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm <laughs> so, uh, so it was close to my heart because I don't think there are enough programmes that we see that we hear um, a voice from the South West which is manifold and different and all the counties are different, Cornwall's from Devon and so on. Uh, and Bristol's completely different yeah, as well. Yeah, so, yeah, <laughs> but we don't hear any voices from really from from the South West, and so it's interesting to be able to do that too. Um, Doc um, Hollywood, that's uh, no, uh, no, Doc Martin, sorry. Doc oh, Martin, Doc Martin. Martin yeah. Doc Martin, that uh, thing, isn't it? You know. Yeah, I think so. There's, mm. I think it's, yeah, it was just nice to mm. hear a different voice. So that was really happy to do it. So I should pass you over. Perhaps to, to Stephen. Oh, yes, Stephen. Um, <laughs> um, I don't have any connection with that part of the country at all. So um, a lot of listening um, was needed, really. Um, but the thing that I really like about the film being set in that particular bit tip of the country, sort of thing, is the fact that it's so isolated. So it's automatically a bit spooky and a bit. And cut off and, and down and there is another world. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> I know that one. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but because no, if what already gets this, because like Marple Bridge, I mean, I, I know, yeah. Yeah, I know Marple Bridge. Yeah. And it's kind of like it's quite, it's kind of interesting. This all between there and then Cornwall, you know, which is I can see the jump. You know, I mean, witches. Let's go to witches. It's all down to yeah. production design, dear. <laughs> <laughs> Productions are right. hopefully <laughs> making that.